of hard work goes into producing a screw attack top 10, like a lot of sleepless nights and restless days are spent just trying to make sure we have a list that we're happy with, and of course is 100% accurate. But for all the superb games that are on our list, there are some great games that didn't quite make it, like in our top 10 fighting games and Night Warriors Darkstalkers Revenge. The original Darkstalkers was like if Capcom and Universal Studios got together to make some ass-kicking love child. Well, Night Warriors is kind of like their demon spawn baby. It's an unholy union of classic monsters and Street Fighter 2 gameplay. But don't cry clone just yet. Night Warriors built on Darkstalkers innovation and continue to lay the groundwork for future fighters like the Marvel vs. Capcom series. Those combos and EX moves you like so much? Yeah, you can thank Darkstalkers. Now back to the monsters. They're what makes the game so much fun. Aside from being weird, you throw in some crazy moves, that's what makes this game stand out from the crowd. What other game had vampires and undead punk rockers? I love Donovan's Monty Python foot and Sasquatch hawking snowman loogies. That's cool. Anarchists can open Stargates and Felicia. Well, let's just say there's plenty of lonely guys out there who played Night Warriors who wanted to pet Felicia's kitty. Because we, because, because they like cats, of course. I mean, she might just be the hottest furry ever if it wasn't for this beauty. If games suck and no one likes them, chances are they're not gonna go anywhere. But whenever Capcom does a crossover, someone from Night Warriors is there. They fought Marvel and SNK, they fought with cards and puzzles, and now they're whooping some Tatsunoko ass. If only they could have crossed over to a show that didn't suck. The cartoon was horrible, but Night Warriors was damn good. And while it didn't make our list, it deserves to be on someone's top 10 list, even though theirs isn't right. And regardless of its positioning on that list, it's safe to say that Japan was into the Darkstalkers series way more than America. And that may be why Night Warriors was just a Saturn quote unquote exclusive. It's kind of sad proof that while Capcom can pretty much do no wrong in the 2D fighter, not everyone appreciates their work. Or cat boobs.